to infinity and beyond. In this action-packed episode, Jacqueline and I celebrate our birthdays in San Antonio and Austin, Texas style. <laughs> Wherever I go, I will always know Everything I need is right here with me It's time to let it all go, no matter who knows Anything about me, no I'm ready to see what life's got for me I got one thing left to say it's Jacqueline's birthday, so we came out to San Antonio to do the river walk. So happy birthday, Jack. Okay, Miss Jacqueline, what do you want for your birthday? To have fun. <laughs> We're gonna go down to the river walk in the Alamo direction. Sweet. The river walk is a gorgeous area consisting of a bunch of canals on the San Antonio River. It's lined with shops, restaurants, and other type of businesses. And if you're up for it, they even offer barge tours. From here, we decided to take a trip into the past and explore a little bit of Texan history. Welcome to the Alamo. The 1836 Battle of the Alamo is one of the most pivotal battles in world history, signifying Texan identity, the fight for liberty and bravery in the face of impossible odds. The final attack came before dawn on March 6, 1836, as Mexican troops charged towards the Alamo. Defenders rushed to the walls to fire into the darkness. Mexican soldiers breached the north wall and flooded into the compound. The fierce battle centered on the old church where defenders made a last stand. The battle lasted only 90 minutes. After two sieges and a bloody battle, many buildings in the Alamo Mission compound were damaged and burnt. If you'd like to learn more about the history of the Alamo, we've included a link in our video description below. Victory or death. After spending much of the afternoon in the crowds of downtown San Antonio, we decided to jump on a scooter and head to the Japanese tea gardens for a little zen time. The Japanese tea garden has been around for over 90 years. It began as a rock quarry that slowly shaped into complex walkways stone arch bridges, an island, and a Japanese pavilion. Local residents donated bulbs, exotic plants were provided by the city nursery, and the pavilion was roofed with palm leaves from city parks. Oh, cool. Yeah. Can I place open or closed? Uh, How cool is this? It's pretty neat. It's beautiful. I'm glad we took our scooter over here. Oh, that's a, a big koi pond. Yeah. Look at that. So we're here at the Japanese Tea Gardens in San Antonio. They are amazing. They're beautiful. It's huge. There's like amazing pads you can wander around and it's pretty quiet. There's koi pond. Tea house structure behind me. I passed by some waterfalls earlier. It's just a really peaceful place. You could spend all day here. So lush and green. Beautiful. Hi. What do you think of the garden? Gorgeous. I love it. They have turtles. That's a good. 
I got one of the koi wing. <laughs> So how's your birthday so far? Fabulous. With everything you hoped it would be. For a Texan birthday, it's not so bad. Tower of the Americas is a well-known Texan attraction that is hard to miss. It stands 750 feet tall and is best known for its spectacular views from the observation deck, 360-degree revolving charter house restaurant, and a 4D theater ride. We are in San Antonio at the Tower of the Americas celebrating Jackson's birthday. Stunning in the sunset light, <laughs> as usual. Are you enjoying your uh, birthday so far? Man, check this place out. So down here, this floor spins. So this is a shrimp crab fondue. Top of a spinning skyscraper. Seared ahi with a pyramid of pilaf. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Go skydiving? No. You go skydiving? Hell no. Let's go. Mm -mm. No. 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 Hell no. 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 I refuse. No. No. Let's go skydiving. No. Let's go skydiving. I'll push you out of plane. <laughs> <laughs> I bet you would. <laughs> All right, it's my 33rd birthday and I'm going skydiving for the first time. Let's check it out. It takes 10 minutes to get up to altitude, six minutes to drop down to the ground. So apparently when we're free falling, we're going 120 miles an hour. I'm not sure what I Here we go. <laughs> so I'm Emery, you'll be with me. Look at your harness up here. First time? Yeah. All right, so you got one job. Let's have fun, okay? Yes. That's it. <laughs> I'm excited. I can't wait. I love jumping out of planes. I've never done it before, but I already love it. <laughs> See you next time. Yeah. Good enough? Yeah. yeah. It should hey, work. Uh, worst case scenario, I'll, we'll hold hands. Yeah. <laughs> just, bring, just bring this back. I need that if you yeah, fall yeah, out yeah. or something. Yeah, yeah, if we fall out of it, I'll yeah. hold on to this with one yeah. hand. I'll hold on to you with <laughs> no. the other. You know, and we'll make it to the ground. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Later. What does it say that my husband wanted to jump out of a plane after a month of marriage? Says he's married to a uh, crazy family. Sorry, your brother-in-law is a daredevil. About to leave. Already back in. Come with me. I'm not really asking. We'll get away to a place where we don't know. About to see. The world in action, what we can be. Life with no distractions, we'll get away. This is what we waited for. Take my hand, we'll make it somehow. We can't miss out. I'm done living life with the lights out. Let's definitely do that. That's definitely 100%. Oh, snap. Alright, you ready? Here we go. Oh, they hit hard. <laughs> <laughs> Good job, man. Hey, Nick. How Dude, was it? That was amazing. Thank Good you. Fun. Thank you so much. It's not looking back. 
on the freeway. Bonnie and Clyde. That was so much fun. Best thing I've ever done, hands down. I feel like my, my heart's gonna explode, yeah, dude. Me too. My, my hands are like, <laughs> like, tingly. Done one skydiving jump. The first step in a long career skydiving. Hey, Dad, we're alive. Don't sound so excited. <laughs> <laughs> it was amazing. The, yeah. the crazy part is when you jump out of the plane. Yeah, it, everything after you're out of the plane, it really doesn't matter because you're either gonna land or you're I enjoyed it. Not. I enjoyed well, yeah, all of I'm that. Saying. It was it's, surreal. But that moment when you when you jump out of the plane, it feels like your heart's gonna explode. <laughs> you guys wanna go to Austin? <sighs> yeah, let's right. go. We are at Cosmic Coffee having a brew for my birthday. And it's pretty cool. Nice little place. At over 800 miles long, the Texan Colorado River is one of the longest rivers to start and end in the same state. Not to be confused with the Colorado River flowing through the western states. Lady Bird Lake Trail is the 10 mile heavily trafficked loop alongside the river. It's primarily used for walking, running, and bicycling. And it'll lead you by skyscrapers, neighborhoods, and cultural attractions. This trail is Austin's most recognized and popular recreational area. We're in Bat Alley in Austin. Apparently it's a big deal. There's a bunch of people lined up along this bridge. I mean, it's shoulder to shoulder waiting for the bats. So we're gonna go check it out. The bats arrived about 10 minutes after their predicted departure. Unfortunately, it was too dark to capture them on camera. So if you notice in the hall, there's a silhouette of a girl. This girl was known to have died in 1993. She fell off the second balcony. So they say that when there's an important show, she'll come back and lead guests to their seats. So I guess we just joined a uh, spooky tour of Austin. Uh, we were asked if we were part of the tour. I told them we were just walking by. I was completely honest with them. He just kind of was like, all right, whatever. There's multiple accounts of people running into Samantha in the hall. Downtown Austin is filled with bustling streets, critically acclaimed restaurants, and entertainment, even during these uncertain pandemic times. Thank you for joining us on our Texan birthday adventures. If you like this episode, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe. We hope to see y'all next Tuesday as our exploration of Texas continues. To my family, if I don't make it to the ground, it was nice knowing you guys. Live for the moment. I wear my sunglasses.